one now. Loyola's having to go against this pressure, hungry defense of the Auburn Tigers. Well, Johnson wants to eat, but he's sharing on Thanksgiving with Devin Cambridge. Katie Johnson left off where he was last night. He said all he's thinking about is getting a W. Really big buckets that took Auburn into both overtimes. Loyal is struggling with the Auburn pressure, and Johnson looks off the pass and buries the three. <laughs> Get the bucket, trying to lead the Tigers to a victory. A lot of times in that UConn game, he would just give him the basketball in space and allow him to make plays. Norris drops a three. Norris, you can't not go behind the screen on Brandon Norris. Personal foul on Williamson. Williamson now goes away from Jabari Smith. Nice little half hook from Cardwell to get his first points, averaging Norris trying to work on the six foot ten Jabari Smith. That's trouble. Shot clock winding down and putting it in for two is Marquise Kennedy. Sophomore out of Arkansas puts Auburn back in front. Hall, good strong take to the basket for two. Nifty little soft turnaround by Jalen Williams. Doesn't waste any time showing that range. To pull their weight coming off a double overtime game. When, when you come in the game, you better be locked in and ready. If you could put your finger on one thing that makes him special, what would that be? What's really impressed me is his energy. And Auburn has 12 points off of those eight Loyola turnovers here in the first half. And there is Jabari Smith, almost on cue. Mike, come on back. Guarded by Tom Welch. Cambridge from outside. We saw him above the rim. We see him outside the three-point line. Three to go. Here's the pride of Nashville at work. Devin Cambridge. You think he's going up around the rim. Williamson hasn't scored yet. Thinks better of it against the seven-foot one. And now he'll reset, drive the baseline, and score. Lucas Williamson. And Severe Wheeler, who's playing at Kentucky right now. The quickness that would have been in the backcourt at the University of Georgia. Schwieger gets the pass from Norris and a good finish by Ryan Schwieger. How quick, getting the ball down the floor before you have to play against Auburn's pressure defense. Two points, 12 for 12 from the free throw line. Jasper for two. And then recovering for the rejection in the corner is Devin Cambridge for Auburn. Cambridge, I believe he has wings. He can fly. Came into this tournament two and two. They were struggling with a couple of losses. They are a little short-handed as the lob goes inside to Jacob Hudson for his first points in the second half. It was not. Pounded into the backcourt, race for the loose ball, won by Auburn's Green. A Cardwell. Just watch the pursuit of the basketball. Count it for three. Junior stretching it out outside the three point line. And not just towing the line, but way back. In that transfer, he was the second leading scorer. Strong take down the lane by Kennedy for two. Green will try a deep three. Heat check in the Bahamas is on. From the outside, a couple of threes, including a deep, deep one for the Tigers. Kessler reached in to knock it away, deflect it, but Hudson. Now everyone who has gotten into the game.
Kessler to the basket for two. Can't roll and be moving with the with the offense, like with the defense. Jabari Smith, that silky smooth stroke knocks it down. Just with the size right now for Auburn, you've got Kessler at 7-1, Smith at 6-10 running around, but attacking the basket and attacking the seven-footer is Kennedy as the shot clock expires. It just comes off his fingers so easy. Kessler says, not in my house. Jacob Hudson thought he was going to go inside, but Walker Kessler said, uh-uh. Not today. Kessler to Smith. The turnaround is good. That's pretty. Watch the mechanics of Jabari Smith. When he catches it, it's just routine. It's textbook. Elbow down. Extend. Williamson and Norris get to score the second half, but Loyola is getting contributions from Marquise Kennedy. In the second half, but it's because of a man to man pressure defense. Smith with a pretty turnaround for two. The lob up top to Kessler. Points, 10 rebounds, five on the offensive end, two steals, and four blocks for Kessler. Look, Green had Devin Cambridge as the first option. Cambridge. Tigers now one and one. The Ramblers now 0 oh and two. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus.